welcome to the first episode of Theme Park Facts. And today, we are taking a look at the top five facts about Disney World and Disneyland and probably some of us. Let's get on to the facts. <laughs> is Main Street USA is based on Walt Disney's town that he grew up in in Minnesota. Even some of the cast members like um, the fortune teller in Main Street USA and her name tag, I think it was Sally or something, that's um, one of the people, one of the people who was from that town so there's some reference from main street to minnesota so because walt but walt disney was born in chicago but i think it's minnesota but hey this is the first episode whatever number two apartments there used to be a pop this apartments kind of in Walt Disney World, in Disneyland, probably, that's it, probably this more, I don't know. But these are the two famous ones. Um, number one, in Disney World. Walt Disney World used to, used to um, plan on making an apartment for his wife and mother, I think it's wife, and he put it like around right here and based off Cinderella. But when Walt Disney died in 1966 of lung ca- cancer, don't smoke kids. Um, that apartment got scrapped, but now is a lucky family who wins a apartment, uh, wins a room for Cinderella Castle, so they could stay all night, but they had to be into their um, room, like, closure time. 24 hours challenge! That's 24 hour challenge right there, boys. But, um, you can, you can still, you can sign up to try to get a room there, but it's, it's like a one to like a million, one to a million people, families, and that's not good. You have to win like a jackpot to get that, like seriously. <laughs> but the second famous apartment, which it's the most popular one, is the fire department in Disneyland. Which that is used to be Walt Disney's apartment when he was alive and working on the projects of Disneyland and the future in Disney World. He used he was try he was looking around to see if his um uh, cast members are doing good and looking if the Horn Tide Park is fine, but. Here's fact number three. When Walt Disney died, um, one of the cast members, one of the cast members was cleaning Walt Disney's apartment, and and then he shut off the lantern because when Walt Disney is in his apartment, he always turned on his light lantern. So he she turned on off his lantern and went out door and then when she was about to run, go out of the door the lantern went on probably be a glitch she turned it back down go back and she flickered again and she was shocked and there was a voice that said i'm still here so th- for now to today that lantern is still on they put more like they 
replace the light bulbs. But still, the lanterns on. So we know that Walt Disney is still looking at the pop, but we cannot see them. Him, we can just speak to him. But number two, number two. These attractions probably like what? These were attractions when they were open. Yes, they are, and I'm going to name like five or seven of them in Disneyland and Disney World. So, sucker in Disneyland. Haunted Mansion used to be like a walkthrough haunted house that was actually named Haunted House. That's kind of. That's like a boardwalk amusement park. Like, I, I went to Tivoli and it would be like that, but. Not an attraction, just a walkthrough. But it it scrapped and made a um made it in a attraction because the technology that they just got in. And also there used to be a Delta flight, but in Disney World, um soaring through I forgot it was, but it was a Delta flight. It's like a plane flight? Holy shoot, what is that? Well, it closed down, and it was a place of Buzz Lightyear Spin Ridge Spin. Or something like that. In Disney World. And there used to be a 20,000 leagues under the sea in Disney World and Disneyland. The Disneyland version... Well, there was some complication things going in Disneyland because of the paint. And it's always refurbishment. So they, and also, the, do you know there used to be real life mermaids? The Disney pays the real life mermaids a dollar a de- hour for acting as mermaids, but... From the condition of the waters, they never did that. Like, they used to do that, but they never did that anymore. But that 20,000 links under the sea was replaced by Mimo, which is a big hit now. And the one in Disney World was replaced by Seven Doors Mine Train, which is a big hit now. Like, you're... The wait times are 180 minutes, so whatever. But Space Mountain is still beating them. And probably Pandora also. Whatever. And and Mr. Toad's Wild used to be in Disney World. It replaced Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Woo! Winnie the Pooh. Woo! And also... There was a, and also, there was two water parks, two water parks in Disney World. This, well, this is the same fact number two. There used to be two water parks in Disneyland, but they are now abandoned. They are abandoned. And it's eh. they're abandoned. The first one was named Discovery Island, which used to be a water park. But when they when Disney opened up Tycoon Lagoon Blizzard Beach, it nobody was going to do, uh, Discovery Island. There was some um, virus going on on the water, like. A brain killing thing, which surprisingly only didn't kill that much because there was ninety ninety five percent uh de- like dangerous and they they anybody didn't get killed like seriously that's that's like that's like a jackpot right there because that's surprisingly not that that's surprisingly. And the last one was, um, well, it used to be a, was it like a lagoon thing? 
Well, it, it, it closed for good, and then they tried to remake it as a video game, Sky Clean, and then it didn't make it. So, yeah. And then, finally, and then, finally, and then, number one, there's a secret club in Disney World, which is in, well, it's with Fobos, well, it's starting getting in Disney World, but the first one is in Disneyland, which is called Club 33, which the first location of Club 33 is at New Orleans Square, right next to Pirates of the Caribbean, kind of. Kind of Pirates of the Caribbean. This Club 33, you have to wait for like a year-long waiting list to get in the club, which that's like, that's a really long time. You can go like, 5,000 cities in the world, and then you can get it. It's like that long. It's really, really long. That is top five Disney facts that you probably didn't know about the Disney box. Probably next video, I will talk about a abandoned ride or a band or a used to be ride, but now it's done. It can be universal, but. Have a magical day, everybody, and happy 4th of July. And also, this is a Lego, Lego Disney castle that it's completed, just completed today. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit the subscribe button to tune in for more theme park, theme, theme park facts. And I will st say goodbye and have a magical day and happy 4th of July for all you folks in America. Sorry, Can Canada. Happy Canadian Day. Three days late. I'm sorry, but still. Happy Canadian. Happy Canada Day. 250. Yeah, wonderful. Yay. Canadians are nice. And also Swedish people are nice. Those two are nice people. But the question of the day is, what's your favorite ride in Disney World or Disneyland? It can be both. But mine is Big Thunder Mountain. Big Thunder Mountain is a classic ride that opened in 1976. I forgot. But I will see you all guys in the next video. Bye.